Hey everyone, welcome back to Daily Stand Up. Today I'm going to report progress uh, basically on the ticket I have uh, right here for wire up notification handling. Um, and if you, you, you probably should take a look at yesterday's stand up or, or really uh, several stand ups before that. But uh, I was trying to illustrate or trying to show um, the state of the project where it's at and the error that I was showing. So basically I'm running into a deserialization error. Again, you can see that in the last video. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get enough time uh, today to work on it. Uh, I actually took time away from this project specifically, uh, and then I wanted to go over, um, uh, I'm going through a book basically for Rust. Um, I have a couple of them that I got from the library. So I want to make decent progress in the book just to really kind of just grasp the fundamentals of the language and the different nuances there uh, there are with the, uh, the syntax um, and, and different things like that so I'm, I'm like just getting into the the chapter that's going to go into um, uh, memory and ownership and things like that so um, I have a little bit to go I should finish it at the current pace uh, in about a week uh, however I'm still probably going to make uh, I'm not going to take a week off from the project but I'm going to try to kind of do these in parallel read the book as well as try to um, debug my own Rust microservice um, and so I'm just taking uh, I'm just taking uh, some notes more or less on um, the content and things like that uh, so that's kind of where I'm at. So that's the main progress. I'm not going to make a new ticket necessarily for uh, learning Rust um, because I, I, I just kind of feel like that's part of these tickets, like that's part of the five-point estimate and everything like that. Uh, so I don't want to, I don't want to make it more complicated than it needs to be. Um, so this this microservice is not going to be completely or, or, or the scope of this ticket is not completely exhaustive to you know completing this uh, specific microservice basically I'm just trying to get it to the just really just the uh, base functionality of reading messages from RabbitMQ um, looping through those messages and then uh, performing logic based on the temperature that is is being sent there, and then send the notification back to their queue. So it's not a lot. It's not a lot happening at all. Um, it's just I have to. I'm in a spot where it would just help me just to know more of the the fundamentals of the language, just to be able to read my own code a little better and debug and all that stuff. Um, so I, I probably would predict that at probably middle of next week I would guess that hopefully I would have had I, I will have kind of sorted out these these errors that I'm seeing um, at the very least hopefully I'll have made the notification queue and be able to uh, publish messages to that queue so that's where I'm predicting that I'll be in about a week um, and I think that that'll put us on track for this uh, project um, I had to do a couple small tweaks to my actual uh, front-end project um, I had to add a temperature property to the uh, the class uh, to the engine model class um, and I think I might have to update that in one more spot I think I might have to update that in my engine API as well because those basically are essentially share the same uh, types so I might have to do that just a couple small things um, but overall it's, it's coming together well um, so again, that's just kind of my uh, quick update for today. I don't really have any code. I've kind of been sitting on these two um, these two videos of just like random code stuff like that. Um, I, I mean, of, of me writing some Rust uh, code. Um, I was gonna kind of throw that together in some kind of uh, some kind of video, more or less. Uh, I don't really know if it's just. I don't really know if it's good content, to be honest with you. Um, <clears throat> I tried to do some of those videos, like those coding montage videos, you know, where it's like I'll do like 
uh, it's some kind of panoramic shots of a desk or something. Um, I don't know if it's worth it at this point it, it, into the projects because I'm really trying to focus on the core functionality. I don't want to take time away from this to, to make those kind of videos. I like doing those, but uh, they take obviously a lot more time to edit and get all the shots and stuff like that. So I don't think I have time to do both currently. Um, but I'll see. Now, at least I don't have time to do it given the format of what I'm trying to do here with the daily stand up videos uh, and just kind of both directly and indirectly work on the project uh, on these videos. So, on the stand up videos. So, we'll see. But I have some footage saved that I might kind of maybe condense into some kind of video. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, that's really all I have for today and so I will see you on the next one.